So today I scare the doll. I don't remember what's happening, I'm gonna be honest. Oh yeah, we're going down. We're gonna meet up with what's his name? At the flower bed, right? I guess we gotta go further west to meet up with the guy. Ichi no so yeah. We're doing basically what we did with um the other guy. Again, we're gonna get another guy from the um lab here killed. This is the place I agreed to meet with Ichinose. Let's keep searching. Oh. Yeah, okay, that I was just... Keep searching is just like, if you don't want to commit to it yet. Wait for Ichinose. I feel somebody is watching me. Am I gonna get killed? A little after 7 p.m., just as the, t the darkness becomes total, Ichinose arrives. Last night, I waited for night to fall like this with Yumino. And then Yumino died, right? Then Yumino called Michael on the phone and I stuck in the professor's office. As we saw. That was where I found my resume. The more I... Sorry, one sec. <coughs> the more I hear of your story, the more confused I get. I don't understand it at all. Neither do I. Did you ask Maiko about the resume? Maiko, she came back to the room right after I found the resume. And? She had a knife. She tried to stab me. No way, I like the exclamation mark. It's true, I know it's hard to believe, but it's true. I can't believe that. That was my water bottle making a weird noise. But what happened after that? Did Maiko stab you? She got shot. I... She does finally acknowledge it. No, when she was about to stab me, she was shot from behind. That's... I can only assume that you're insane. You have to be lying. I can't believe a word of it. I'm sure that everything is just as it always was. You may be right, I may be insane, but I am also 100% serious about what I'm saying. I don't ask you to believe me, but I do want you to admit that I'm not telling lies. And, if you will, I'd like you to help me. I know you believe what you're saying. The resume, at least, isn't a lie. I did hear a few rumors about a person who was in my year before I came here. And I've always been curious about what is kept in the basement. All students are explicitly forbidden from going down there. Anyone caught trying to go down will, there will be expelled. Of course, the door is always locked. Back to what you were saying earlier. You say Maiko tried to kill you then, she got shot from behind, right? Then who shot her? And more to the point, how is she working here today as if nothing, hap uh, nothing at all happened? Cloning, I'm guessing, but I think the one who shot her might be Yumina. Yumina didn't show up today, but I don't think he has a gun. I don't know anything for sure. I wish this were all some dream. After that, I lost consciousness, and when I woke up, I was on the bed in my sister's apartment. Somebody carried me there. I see, that's why you think it might have been Yumina. We stopped talking and wait quietly. For the dead of night. I mixed up the word order there, it always throws me off when I do. I feel like everything will become clear if we can find the fifth report in the basement. With this ID card, we can access the underground lab. Head to the basement after midnight. We just wait out here for five hours, just Laying in the flowers. December 22nd. Oh, that's a new image and it's a very scary one. I don't like it. It's almost 3 in the morning. Every light in the place has been turned off. Swipe your ID card there. 
The student cards we have don't work on this door. Insert ID card. I insert the ID card into the slot of the security device. The door unlocks. Okay, here we go. Okay, now we're probably at the end of, uh, near the end of Scar the Doll. I am a bit scared, actually. The, um, the background image has such, like, a... I don't know what it is. Something about it is, like, really weird and off-putting to me. As we open the door, I get the sense that it has not been opened for a very long time. What is this place? There are stairs leading down, but it is too dark to see anything. I will walk ahead. Oh, Ichinosu is going to get killed. Maybe something jump scary vaguely? I've got a flashlight. Good. With the faint light of Ichinosu's flashlight, we walk cautiously down the stairs. It's cold. This is like the cold of night. The deeper down we go, the colder it gets. I can't see well. I should have brought a better flashlight. As Ichinoshi says, the flashlight only illuminates a few steps ahead in the pitch darkness. Ichinose stops. What's wrong? It's a dead end. No, it isn't. Shine your flashlight there. Is this a doorknob? Oh, I didn't mean to. Sorry. Is this a doorknob? Another door? Do you think you can open it? I don't know. I'll give it a try. I think... I think it'll open. Ready? I'm gonna open it. Uchinosu seems to be drumming up the courage to open the door. The side of his face, faintly illuminated, seems to be shaking. I don't blame him. Like myself, I am sure he senses something terrifying lurking behind this door. I don't know how much longer is in this game. I might end up having to like cut the YouTube video here in half. So I'm giving myself a bit of time here to potentially like cut the video here. If it does, I'm sorry you'll have to wait till tomorrow if like depending on how long this takes, but we'll see. Ichinose turns the doorknob. I'm waiting for a jump scare to open the door. Uh, boy, you and me, buddy. We'll see what happens. It's so dusty. Quiet. That's such a stupid sound. What's wrong? I thought I heard something from up above. Did you? I didn't hear anything. Ichinose shines his flashlight towards the top of the stairs. That's not a good idea. I think it's just your imagination. You're probably just nervous. Yeah, I guess so. Just my imagination. Yeah, we know where that's going. I'm going inside. Suppressing this fear, Ichinose opens the door. To the lab basement. Another new um, background image. Very spooky. I don't like it. The door opens onto a wide hallway. There are doors to the left and right. Ahead is dark. Oh, come on, dude. One of these is right, the others are wrong, and there's no way of us knowing. So we, we have to save here, right? This is where the stopping point for the video is going to be. We save. Uh, yeah, slot 7. And we will um, do this here next video. I'm sorry, this is a little bit of a shorter one, but I I mean, this is where the stopping point of the game naturally is, right? So, tune in next time to watch me just blindly work through these choices until something happens.